What is up, risk takers? Welcome to the Kill Pete Strategy. I am Pete. I am a top player playing Risk Global Domination on PC. I have a daily release on YouTube. I do fix Friday every Friday. I do the Waiting on Your Best Behavior podcast, and I stream on Twitch as often as I can. If you are interested in getting better at the game of Risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channel and come along the ride with me for today's episode. We're doing a group of my favorite settings. Looks like we have two bots in this game. Playing Britannia Advanced World Dawn Progressive, and I'm in the first position. I'm going to take my very favorite territory on this map on the first turn. One of, one of my very favorite territories. So, I move into one of my two preferred positions for Britannia Advance right off the bat. And we are going to... Yeah, we get a pretty good start off there. So settings for this game, we're playing World Domination on Britannia Advance, auto setup, 60 second turn, expert AI, looks like we start with two. Progressive cards, balance blitz dice, with no filtering of players, alliances are on, and fog and blizzards are off. I'm in the first position, this is the main P account, and I am currently ranked uh, 127th on the World Leader board, playing these settings world free for all world on progressive in position two we have r.i.p ashby flying the flag of the united kingdom playing as yellow in position three general swaminathan 13519 from the united states of america playing as magenta in position four we have an expert ai in position five we have an expert ai and in the final position we've motel flying the flag of poland playing as blue We're playing a four-player game and we are doing a warm-up for round five of the Risk Legends tournament, and that is coming up in 40 minutes. So we'll have time to play this game, and then we'll get right to the tournament game probably. Maybe if I can fit in a round of Jeopardy in the interim. Parlox, when is your tournament game? It's in about 40 minutes. How is everyone doing? Warfine, thank you for the subscription, man. Thank you so much. I'm doing this one live on Twitch. And we're trying to get to that top 100, but what a hard grind, if I ever saw one. All right, so my next move is I'm gonna to wanna to move these two positions together. And it looks like I'm gonna to wanna to hang out here because uh, blue, seven is in, blue seven is in my preferred position in the north. Yeah, that's fine. This is fine. And I still have linkages to my other two stack in the bottom. So I'm going to move out of Yellow's way. I'm going to give him an alliance request at this point so he knows that I'm leaving and friendly. Right? You see how I'm leaving? You can take Scotland and you can eliminate Blue 7. Um, the reason I like alliances on Britannia Advanced, so Britannia Advanced is similar to Pangea in that it has a jackpot, except it only has one, whereas Pangea has two. So Pangea has a three for two and a two for two in Oceania and Antarctica. Britannia Advanced only has whales. So whales is a six for six, but it's the only, there's only four bonuses, and it's the most likely one that people are going to go for. So if you have any troops spawned in whales, you leave. And you leave as quickly as possible because this shit happens, right? Magenta is going to go slamming it. Magenta doesn't know how to play, so they're going to roll 3b2s and lose. Yep, there we are. Risky Phil is here. Hey, Phil. Should I lose on my alt to jump you up a spot? You're not in this game. Oh, no, no, no. I see what you mean. No, 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 no. On your alt. Uh, what's it called? Um, the name escapes me, but no, I'm I'm happy to, to win and lose on my own merits, sir. But I do appreciate it. What's your favorite map, Pete? Mine is Earth 2209. I like this. I like Pangea. I like Earth 2209. Depends on what the settings are. Yeah, so Whitebot is interested in taking whales. So Magenta is going to have a fight with Whitebot, which I like. Let's see if we can figure out what Blackbot wants. I'm going to lose one of my twos, potentially. Okay, these two being exited, I can move the six down. I can pull that two up. This two is still next to the six. Blackbot is aggressive. Aggressive, aggressive. All right, I'll be in two positions. Don't love it. Better than nothing, though. Looking forward to Classic Fix. It's off. Yeah, Noble Trenchard is the name. I'm glad you said no because I would never do it. Of course you wouldn't. Of course you wouldn't, man. It's all good. Why would I want that anyways, right? I want to win my own games. 
I don't need people to give me games. I can only save one of my twos from Black's Relentless Assault. It looks like these twos are more likely to live than that one, so I'm going to move this one into the eight now. Kill Pinko. Well, I'm going to kill them all. <laughs> don't you worry. I'm going to kill absolutely everyone. <laughs> Or at least that is my intention. Okay. So yellow is going to leave blue with a 10 stack behind their lines. So usually if I'm sitting up in the Orkneys, which is all things being equal, my other favorite position on this board someone isn't trying to take Scotland. If a player is trying to take Scotland, it changes the equation, because then they're just as likely to take their first set and slam it into you. The alliance is on change the math here. This seems like a great time to turn on the alliances with the other two players. See who wants to be nice with me. Magenta says, cool. Magenta is likely going to die to me. They're going to be in a single position. Ugh. Too bad for Magenta. Would I enter a classic fixed tournament? Yeah, I don't see why I wouldn't. Hey, Rwanda, how's it going? I like classic fix. I just made Grandmaster playing classic fix for the first time. Yeah, this black bot is aggressive. We have two strong bots in this game. I'm going to have to avoid getting hit by the bot. That would suck. Blue puts on the 11. Yeah, blue puts down here hits where? Northern Island? Seven goes up? No, two goes down. Okay. Well, this playing a pretty good game in two positions. I have a reasonably good kill line on Magenta. I'm going to move into Isle of Man. So I have a third position like this. I like Isle of Man on this map a lot. If I were to say I would have uh, three favorite territories, obviously... Uh, Sussex, Orkneys, and then my third would probably be Isle of Man. Right in the middle of the board, but not really blocking anyone's territory. It just connects in every direction. I don't play this game myself. I found you by random YouTube algorithm. I want to let you know that I love the energy and what you do. Keep up the good work, and you'll have me watching in the future. Thank you, Cain. Thank you, thank you. I'm so, so over the moon that people are enjoying my work. I'm grateful. Thank you guys so much. It means a lot. How am I? I'm great. I'm having a great day. Probably going to lose the Risk Legends tournament. I'm in almost last place, so even a perfect game, I don't think, advances me to... We're cutting, I think, what do we have, 25 players cut to top 12 for the semis? So I have to be in the top 50% of points, but I'm in last place. So. We're just playing for funsies, guys. But that's all right. I got some real good competitors in my upcoming game. I'm playing against Under the Gun, Free For All Tournament Champion, Team Risk Tournament Champion, Top 10 Grandmaster. We're playing against Phil. Phil, I actually don't know. We're playing against Sir Tyler, Free For All Tournament Champion, um, 1v1 Pro, Top 100 Grandmaster. And we're playing against the Big Heitzung, who does work on Twitch. Okay. I'm happy with my line on Magenta still. That will get hit, I would imagine. Where do I get my take? Remove the bot stack there, hook around. Feeling good about this. Yeah, it's not risky, Phil. It's a different Phil. I don't know. Do, do, who in chat knows Phil in my group? I don't, have I have I played them before? I'm gonna ask in the in the VC. I hope he VCs. Yeah, sounds like a great field. It is. It is everyone in uh, everyone in the surviving in the Rust Legends tournament is quite good. 
Let's see how yellow plays it. So yellow is going to take most of Scotland without taking the 12, which means blue is behind him. Blue didn't ally with me. Okay, magenta, single stack, hits a one. Yep, not playing it risky. I have a lot more material than... Okay, so now they're going to expand out. This is a terrible move for magenta. So the first time white has a bonus... It's just as likely they roll that 9v9. You got lucky, Magenta. You need to get out of Wales because you're fighting with a bot. Black already set. Both bots have set. So the, the current trade is six, and it looks like I get the eight. Cumberland and Fortieu. Do I have either of those? I have this one or this one to put the bonus. I'll put the bonus on this one if, if I can. No. Yeah, I can do that. Okay. All right. Forced to trade. First trade, I get the eight. line myself up to make the kill on magenta next turn unless they set and if magenta sets which they absolutely should do <laughs> then i can make a kill on them later yellow player sets and gets the 10 is this when we see blues 15 die let's just hasten this <laughs> Ooh, they're gonna hit blue over there so here's another reason why I like Orkneys. If you leave the map up like that, you don't even know they're up there. Yellow decides I'm going to take Ireland. Okay. Blue sitting with five cards in their exterior position all the way in the north in the Orkneys. Gando says Phil's a regular in speedy streams. Okay. So maybe I have played them. I'm not sure. Always fun to see and meet new great isn't it? All right, magenta sets. Magenta is going to take Wales. All right, so they're going to queue up white. No set. I can't kill white. So both magenta and yellow playing it like it's fixed. Blue in the top going to set get the 15. I can't kill white unless this four is gone. Actually, I can't kill white at all. Because all of my material is south. Can I kill black? That actually might make more sense. Black's going to have three cards. I'm better lined up to do it. Do I have enough material? Do we see a break? I think I can kill black. Yeah, we do. Okay, so blue sets gets the 15. They're in a single position. They're going to hurt yellow. I betcha. You hit white, you help me. Keep hitting. You ignore me, lol, just see if you remember. I, rem I remember everybody, man. This is awesome to have so many people playing and watching. I'm really happy to see the game grow. <laughs> All right. Got to line myself up to make a kill when I have cards. So we're in a position like this. 
back to Isle of Man. So now I have lines on black, I have lines on white, I have lines on purple. And I have cards, yeah? Good. Okay. So now how do I sequence? Yellow sets and gets the 20. Is yellow going to punch blue out of existence? I'm in a really good position right now. I can pretty much kill any player next turn except for yellow. I'd ideally want to kill someone with four cards. Looks like white will, unless this queues up white for magenta to take. Because white is super weak. Could magenta kill them? No, because magenta doesn't have cards. Okay, so I kill white, kill magenta, kill black, kill blue, and then kill yellow. I can sweep this turn. Cool. I win this game. Everyone dies. Everyone dies. Yay. Watch this. Whew. Everyone dies. <laughs> it's going to be a great turn. Does blue have cards? Pete, do you meditate? Yeah, I not as much as, um, as I used to. I've been very busy with this project, but... Um, yeah, I want to get my discipline back in terms of health and fitness. No! Blue is a set! Blue is a set! Can blue kill white in time? Probably not. Are they moving? They're going for it! They're going for it! Oh, baby! They got it. Blue is good and fast. Okay. Doesn't trigger an in-turn set. <laughs> They're going to kill Magenta. That will, though. Fuck. This is bad. This now is bad. Okay. Fuck that up. No. He's got it. He's got it. He gets another 30 seconds. Don't hit me. Fuck. I was so sure. Flying himself up to kill black. He doesn't have the time. Yes, he doesn't have the time. Good. I get that kill. Okay. I mean, obviously, I need to kill blue after this. Putting in 75 to take 65, I think that'll do. Fuck yeah. Pete, you're my favorite YouTuber streamer. Thanks, man. Thank you so much. I aim to please. Give him a good game. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope you found some of it fun and entertaining, maybe even a little bit educational and informative. 
defeating two beginners and a novice. Let's see, we go from 127 to 126, just one rank point for today. Hope you all enjoyed. If you are interested in getting better at the game of Risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channel and come along the ride with me. I have a daily release on YouTube. I do Fix Friday every Friday. I do the Waiting on Your Best Behavior podcast, and I stream on Twitch as often as I can. And until next time, for all of you on the path to world domination, good games and good luck. All right, that was a real quick one.